Uh-oh, somebody's got to clean this mess up. Not me. I'm very busy. If you didn't know by now, corgis shed so much. As in, every day is like shedding season. To help with their shedding, or even just to keep any dog's fur healthy, it's important to brush their fur regularly. In this video, we'll share with you our thoughts on common dog brushes. All of the products you'll see in this video are in Cooper's Amazon store. To go there, check out the link in the description below. Let's start with a very popular brush, the Furminator. This was the first brush we used on Cooper when he was a little puppy. We didn't know any better then, when we just decided to get it after it was recommended to us. But after realizing how bad it was, we decided to stop using it. First of all, it looks just like a razor. The cool thing about this though is that you can press this gray slider and it releases the fur that brush captures. It seems like a neat little gadget that might work for some dogs, but the Furminator is just not for us. And let me show you why. You see how sharp this metal is? See how harsh the brush is on a human's skin. After just a few strokes, it hurts like hell. Imagine doing that to your dog's skin over and over again. We also noticed that the Furminator would pull not only the undercoat, but it also shreds and pulls the healthy top coat as well. That thing hurts my booty. <laughs> when we used to brush Cooper's fur with the Furminator, he would always whine, even if we brushed him lightly. He obviously didn't enjoy being brushed when we used the Furminator, so we stopped using it and we decided to try other brushes instead. Yeah, we're not big fans of the Furminator. See the description below if you want more information about it. This is the JW Undercoat Rake. This brush also has a metal comb, but compared to the Furminator, which is made up of a sharp, finer metal comb, the JW Undercoat Rake is dull. We still use this from time to time, but because it's still metal, we're also careful to only use it lightly and sparingly on Cooper. And as you can see, Cooper likes it very much. This is pretty effective in capturing the undercoat. So you're saying all of that came off of my butt? That can't be right. It's also easy to remove the fur from the rake. It can still be harsh on the skin after a few strokes, but it's not as bad as the Furminator. So when using this brush, just make sure to use it gently and only for a few strokes in a given area. If you want to know more about this brush, check out the description below. We're selling it in our Amazon store. By the way, don't forget to check out Cooper's Amazon store. 
Everything we use and recommend to raise a healthy, happy dog are all in there. And if you know someone who has a dog, tell them we said hi and to check out our store as well. They might find something there that they could use to make their doggy happy. This brush is the JW Slicker Brush Soft Pin. As the name suggests, this brush is made up of pins, but they're not that soft. This slicker brush has the same stern handle as the JW undercoat rake we saw earlier, but the brush head is made up of several metal pins. As you can see, it's hard to remove the fur after using it to brush Cooper. We're not big fans of this brush because as you can see, a few gentle brush strokes is harsh on the skin. Now imagine doing that over and over again to your dog's skin. I don't think your dog would like it. Cooper doesn't seem to mind it that much, as long as the brush strokes are light and aren't repeated on the same area over and over again. This brush is called the Kong Zoom Groom Brush. Zoomies! I have to say, this brush is one of our favorite brushes to use on Cooper's fur. It's made out of a soft silicone that has a rubbery texture. When you use it, not only does it softly pulls the undercoat, but it also gives Cooper a gentle massage. As you can see, it's gentle on the skin. Ooh, look at that undercoat.
To learn more about this product, check out the description below. Cooper's selling this in his Amazon store. We really like this brush. Here's another soft silicone brush that we love. It works just like the Kong Zoom Groom brush, but this brush has finer teeth than that brush we used earlier. We love the feel of this brush on our hands, and Cooper loves getting brushed when we use this one. As you can see, it's easy to get the fur out of this brush. Look how relaxed Cooper is right now. This is nice. It's so easy to use this brush that even Cooper can handle it himself. <laughs> You can even use a vacuum cleaner to remove the fur, but it's not really necessary. These silicone brushes are so soft, you can even use it on Cooper's hedgie. <laughs> on chicken. And even piggy. Uh-oh. Somebody's got to clean this mess up. Sorry, but I have some work to do. Oh, and by the way, we highly recommend getting a handy vacuum cleaner. It helps make cleanup so easy. We recommend this one. If you want to know more about it, check out the description below. You want to know something funny? We actually save some of Cooper's fur every year. You guys are weird. <laughs> I must say, my fur smells pretty good. And so for us humans, we like to use this brush to help remove the fur from our clothes. Check out the description below for more info. If your dog is not a big fan of getting brushed, try giving treats to encourage positive experience. But of course, even before doing that, you might want to ask yourself if you need to find the right brush that works for you and your dog. It took us some trials and errors before we found the right brush for us, so that might be the case for you and your dog as well. If you have any questions or want to share what you use to brush your dog's fur, let us know in the comments below. All of the products you've seen in this video are in Cooper's Amazon store. To go there, check out the link in the description below.
that's it for now. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're new to this channel, please subscribe and hit the bell icon so you don't miss our new videos. Until next time, thanks for watching!